The first step in getting started on YouTube is to create your own company channel. If you already have a company channel, you can organically optimize your channel with the tips below. First up, selecting your channel name. Now, in a perfect world, your channel name will be your business name. If your business name is already taken, get as close to your business name as possible. For example, you could abbreviate your name or add or delete identifiers such as Inc. If the product or service you're promoting is singular or in a clear niche, try to look for a creative, catchy, and memorable channel name. However, you must be forward thinking when you select your channel name. For example, if you expand your product lines in the future, would you have two separate channels or one cohesive channel? If appropriate, you could even use your first and last name as your channel name. Consider keywords, but remember that trending keywords are in constant flux. Currently, you can create up to 50 channels, but in most cases, it's more strategic and time efficient to have one channel with lots of videos and playlists, rather than several individual channels. But we'll talk more about strategy in the next segment. Next up, optimizing your images. If you're familiar with optimizing blog posts and website images prior to uploading them to your website, the concept is the same. This is one of those tiny details that many people underestimate or simply don't know exist, but can go a long way in organic YouTube and search engine optimization. The best way to optimize your images is to use Google Trends or a paid keyword tool to identify the best keywords. Then, name and save your YouTube profile pic and banner with the most suitable keywords. Even if you're using your company logo, you must first name and save it with your relevant keywords. Even if you maintain the same profile pic and banner, Update them both with new keywords on a quarterly basis. Next, it's tempting to simply copy and paste the About section of your website in YouTube or your other online platforms, sales sites, and social media channels. However, it's important to write unique descriptions for each of your online descriptions. This minimizes the amount of duplicate online content, but it also ensures you have unique descriptions relevant to the purpose of each online profile. For example, your YouTube description should touch on the value you plan to add with your channel via videos, not just who your company is and what you do. Once you've written a few unique sentences or paragraphs, take the time to add the About section links to your website, other social platforms, and top trending news. 